वाइफ आदमी 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 सॉरी आदमी आदमी आई क्लिक ऑन सबमिट एज यू कैन सी इट सेज वर्ड्स वेलकम आदमी फॉर चार्ज फॉर ओपन ए आई चार्ज जी बी सी रियली मेक ग्रेट सेंस ए गाइज वेलकम अगेन टू माई चैनल इन दिस टू दिस वीडियो वी आर गेन टू बी लर्निंग हाउ टू यूज चार्ज जी बी सी टू बिल्ड पी एच पी हाउ फ्रॉम स्क्रैच टू फिनिश सो वी आर गेन टू बी बिल्ड इन ए सिंपल लॉग इन पेज सो टू गेट स्टार्टेड विच वी आर गेन टू एड आउट टू चार्ज डॉट ओपन ए आई डॉट कॉम यू लॉग इन योर अकाउंट सो लेट्स नेविगेट डाउन टू दी पेज सो एज कैन सी आई एम लॉग इन टू दिस प्लेस एंड सो फार आई हैव टेस्टेड एवरीथिंग एंड it's it's quite amazing so what i want to do now is let me zoom my screen so that you can see what we are typing so here and i'm going to um i'm going to ask the chat gpt to teach me how to create a login page in php so let's say i don't know so hello gpt so let's start doing that so um teach me php oh don't worry I just go straight to the point how to create how to create a simple login page in PHP yeah so let's see so it says sure i can help you create a simple login page in PHP here is a step by step guide to do that so first is create the html yes that's correct and here we have the uh, form method post action empty yes awesome awesome label username okay password username cool so that works so and the following code is the php on top of the file to check if the form has been submitted good so here we have request method post awesome so check if post username and uh, if post username and password is not empty awesome and here we have username is equals to username password is equals to password awesome check if username and um, password are correct so if username is equals to username and password equals to username then do this and log into welcome.php else echo username not uh, valid or password and also if everything went well but except this guy is empty is going to tell that please enter username and password good so replace username and password with your actual username awesome create a new file called welcome.php and add the following code to it awesome so here we have session starts because session is actually required to process this session username cool cool so here now we have the welcome page so if you set username if this session is set then we have welcome this session else redirect back to login.php amazing so now before we tell charge bt that it is correct we need to copy this code and run it on our server let's see if it's going to work so this first one here is login.php so let's copy this guy login.php so in my own case i'm going to use, instead of using login.php i'm going to create index.php because we need a landing page for any php file to run i hope you understand so i'll copy this code after copying the code i paste it into this place click on save and the next thing it says add the following php code as the top of the file to check if the form has been submitted to validate the input so this code has to be at the top of our page so i'll copy this code and drop this guy down because that is the only way it will work exactly can you see so all this is generated by chargpt and here we have a uh, session start which started the session based on what he explained down there let me show you it says replace okay you know where is the session start uh actually it didn't talk about session start create a new file called login open the open the file and the following html code add add the following html code to it to validate it and we have session starts so let's see if we're going to talk about it replace hey, username password create a new file called welcome okay that's now okay that's it now when the user enter their username and password to submit page recovery check if the user input is valid it will start the session awesome it says it's stated it you start the session and redirect the user to the welcome page and if the input is invalid or incomplete an error is going to be displayed awesome so that's valid that's valid so let's now uh, try to do that so let me explain this code to you so this is session start that is going to allow this guy to work this session username so here we have what your username and here we have what your password so we're going to be using um uh, username admin and password add me exactly so that will be our username and password so once that is valid then it's going to be this so 
let me click on save and click on save over here so let's now copy our welcome.php so copy code and let's create the welcome.php so here we are going to have welcome welcome.php paste so i think that is correct awesome so so on the redirect page we instead of going to login.php we are going to use index.php because we need the landing page so click on save so i can see based on what i can see so far everything is correct yeah it will it will run it will run perfectly so i'm going to head down to my um, server area then look at all slash uh slash test then slash slash chat gbt chat gpt enter and as you can see let me zoom my screen so that you can see the screen very well so here i have my username as test user so if i try this it will show an error invalid username and password that is this guy that we have here invalid username and password but if it is empty let's say it's empty we did not pass anything click on send please enter username and what and password this is it here. so if we eventually get this right that is we have the admin and we have the admin as the password username admin ad, and password admin so if i have admin 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 sorry admin admin and I click on submit as you can see it says what welcome admin so this is a great innovation for chat uh for open ai chat gpt really make great sense i love it. it's awesome so guys if you also want to do more amazing things with chat gpt you can try it out and give me feedback thank you for more for taking your time to watch this current video please and please subscribe to my channel so we can do more amazing co amazing content like this Okay guys, see you in the next one. Bye.